A new report commissioned by the town of Vegreville, Alberta, reveals what everyone with half a brain knew all along, that if Justin Trudeau kills 300 well-paying jobs there, the town will be utterly destroyed. Now, Vegreville's in east-central Alberta, and besides being home to the world's largest Easter egg, it also has a federal immigration processing center that employs nearly 300 people. Now, that's a major employer in a town of about 5,000. But in the fall, the Liberals decided they were going to close the immigration centre and move it to Edmonton over an hour away. The town's new report reveals that if the centre closes, up to 420 people could move out of the town. That's almost 10% of the town's entire labour force. And for those people who stay behind, their home values could fall by 30%. Now that's on top of the 17% drop the bad economy has already caused. Imagine losing nearly half the value of your home. That's what Vegreville is facing right now because Justin Trudeau wants to give their jobs to Edmontonians. Vegreville Mayor Myron Hayduck told Global News the government's decision to close the processing centre means Vegreville will be older, smaller and poorer. This is exactly the opposite of what the government promised to do for rural Canada in the last election. Now, why did the town even have to do this analysis? Don't federal governments do this sort of economic study before they make decisions they repeatedly claim are based on economic reasons? Yeah, usually, but these are the Trudeau Liberals and they just won't say what study they've done, if any at all. The Conservative MP for the region, Shannon Stubbs, has been trying to get answers for her constituents. She's even using the power of the order paper to compel the government. She asked the feds in her order paper questions if there were any economic impact studies conducted related to the closure of the Vegreville Centre on the town of Vegreville and if so, what are the details of these studies? And I think Stubbs questions the motives for moving the Vegreville Immigration Processing Centre. You can tell by her order paper questions. She thinks the government had ulterior motives. Just look at her first question here. She asks... What is the address where the new centre will be located? I bet she wants to know if it's going to a Liberal riding. I know I do. Unemployment is up in Alberta, a third of a percent to 8.8 percent. 24,000 more Alberta jobs are just gone. That brings the running tally up to 220,000 Alberta jobs just vaporized from the economy. The only place that's not swimming in unemployment and economic disaster is the government hub of Edmonton. And what's Justin Trudeau's solution to all this? Kill a small town and give liberal progressive voters in Edmonton their jobs. For The Rebel.media, I'm Sheila Gunreid. At The Rebel, we bring you the other side of the story. The stories of the Albertans and their communities that are hurt by Justin Trudeau and Rachel Notley and their bad policies. To never miss a story, click the link below to subscribe today.